Hey guys, Rob here from the Doja Life, and today we're going to be calling out Rostami Self-Defense and the Persian Bodyguard. Now, the first major flaw that I saw when watching Rostami Self-Defense and the Persian Bodyguard's videos were that they smack around their students. I mean, just their slaps up and down students' faces. It's quite ridiculous. <laughs> You're from Iran, you're currently teaching in Canada, but yet have never served in the U.S. military. So why are you decorating your apparel like this? You calling me a liar? Well, I ain't calling you a truther! Next, I tried to check them out on their website. When I looked on their website, I did notice that they said that their grandfather had founded Russian Sambo. Nope. These guys did. You sit on a throne of lies. Listen, here's what he had to say about teaching Russian Samba. Hello? Yeah, I was just curious if you guys taught Samba. So, the Samba thing was that, uh, about my grandfather, so we are not teaching that anymore. So, as you check on the website, we have our own document system, and uh, so it's more into modern combat. Maybe I can give him that one, right? Maybe he doesn't teach Russian Sambo because his grandfather taught it and he long, longer wants to teach it. You know, like, why would anybody want to teach an art that their grandfather passed down to their father and then so on? I mean, who would do that? Then I noticed that he said he had a red and black belt in jujitsu on his Instagram page. Let's see what he had to say about that. Yeah, so I'm not going to teach you jujitsu. If you're going to learn my system, I'm going to teach you my own system. So I'm not gonna teach you jujitsu, or even if you would ask me pay me thousands of dollars, I'm not gonna teach you that. So you don't teach Sambo, which your grandfather apparently started, and you don't teach jujitsu, which apparently you've had a coral belt in since you were 18 years old. What the hell do you teach? Yeah, I've done all the systems. From Kali to Wing Chun to Jujitsu to kickboxing, boxing, Muay Thai, thing or something. So when you train with us, you will become a little bit more sort of martial arts. And also you would learn things that is more beyond other systems. What are you ranked in? I, I noticed on the, the website, I can't see absolutely any ranking on there. Yeah, I have four down in Jiu Jitsu, six down in the Ido, four down in Kickboxing, so I have almost up to a down above. Oh man, awesome. But uh, I'm not teaching you those things. So final thoughts here. Um, as far as I can tell, had they probably trained in some martial arts? Yes, of course, I think they have trained in some martial arts. Do I believe that their grandfather founded Russian Sambo? Hell no, he didn't found Russian Sambo. Um, do I think that there's some stolen valor here? Yes, there's plenty of stolen valor here. They're wearing military uniforms. Uh, is the dude in shape? Sure he's in shape. Um, does he know some martial arts? Sure he does. Do I think that he probably would do well in acting? Probably. Could he do st good stunt choreography? Yes. Um, but do I think that they probably lied and fibbed on that resume quite a bit? Yes, definitely have. So. Um, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below. Also, let me know if you have any other of these martial arts frauds or phonies that pop up. Please let me know. I'll do the best I can to research them. I'd like to do one of these once a month. Keep martial arts legit. Yeah.